Nikon enthusiasts, there's a new buzz in the air. A fresh rumor is swirling about Nikon's potential new DX format mirrorless camera, the Nikon Z80. This revelation is particularly intriguing, as it comes right when we were expecting the Nikon Z50 Mark II to make its debut later this year. The sudden emergence of the Z80 rumor has certainly stirred up excitement. So, what do we know about the Nikon Z80 so far? Let's dive into the latest details and what they might mean for Nikon's camera lineup. The Nikon Z80 is rumored to come equipped with hybrid in-body image stabilization, IBIS, a feature already found in the Nikon ZF and Nikon Z6 Mark III. Hybrid IBIS combines optical and digital stabilization, delivering exceptionally stable shots and smoother video footage, even when your hands aren't perfectly steady. This could be a game changer for those who often shoot in challenging conditions. Another exciting aspect is the inclusion of the Xpeed 7 image processor. This processor is known for its dual data stream technology, which enhances performance and speed. For users, this translates to quicker processing, better autofocus, and overall improved image quality. The Xpeed 7 has already proven its value in other Nikon models, so its presence in the Z80 suggests Nikon is aiming for top-notch performance with this release. The rumors also hint that the Z80 might set new standards for video performance in APS-C cameras. While details are still emerging, it's suggested that the Z80 could offer high-quality 4K recording, possibly with enhanced frame rates and color depth. This would make the Z80 a compelling option for those who need both high-end video and photography capabilities. Previously, the focus was on the Nikon Z50 Mark II, which was expected to be an incremental upgrade over the original Z50. However, the buzz around the Z80 suggests that Nikon might be positioning this new model as a more advanced option in the DX format lineup. If the Z80 comes to life, it could represent a significant leap forward in performance, potentially making the Z50 a more budget-friendly alternative. Of course, there are still many questions left unanswered. Will the Z80 feature a new sensor? What about its connectivity options and battery life? How will its size and ergonomics compare to the Z50 and other DX format models? We're eagerly awaiting these details. The speculation alone is generating a lot of excitement. Whether you're a current Nikon user or considering making a switch, the potential of the Z80 is something to look forward to. If Nikon delivers on the rumored features, the Z80 could significantly impact the DX format camera market with its advanced performance and capabilities. In the meantime, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Are you excited about the rumored features of the Z80? How do you think it will stack up against Nikon's current DX format offerings? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Stay tuned for more updates as we continue to track the latest developments in Nikon's camera lineup.